In this lesson, we're going to take a look at how to get started with Brizzy Sync. Now, Brizzy Sync is a really useful feature, especially if you want to build sites on one server or on the Brizzy Cloud, and you want to link any designs that you create and make them available anywhere that you log in to your Brizzy account. So let me just demonstrate what I'm talking about. Let's say, for example, we like the look of this section at the top. We can simply come over to the options in the top right hand corner, open those up and choose the little heart option. This will then allow us to save this. Now, the first thing we're going to need to do the first time we kind of come and use this is log in to our account. So what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we log in with our Brizzy account details. So once I pop my Brizzy account details in, I'm going to click on connect. And now we're all connected up between my site that I have on screen at the moment and my Brizzy cloud account. So all I need to do now is go ahead and choose to save any of my sections or any of my entire layouts. So let's take a look at the difference between the two of those. Let's say I like this hero section and I want to save this. All I need to do is come over to the section itself, click on the little pop out, and just choose the option to save this. And that's basically it. We've now saved this section. The difference between saving a section and saving an entire layout just basically comes down to where you choose the option to save. So each of the different sections, we use the pop out. To save an entire layout, we simply come down to the little arrow to the right hand side of the update button, open that up and choose the option for save layout. Once you've done that, that's going to take a second or two that will then save that to our account. And there we go, all done. So let's have a look at where our saved designs are actually located. Let's open up the option to see our browser. So we're going to click as if we're going to add a new section and inside our browser, we're going to open up the save tab. Now inside there, if we take a look on the left hand side, you'll see we've got blocks and we've got layouts. This is where we can see what's organized into the di different types of templates. So if we open up the layouts, you can see there's our entire page layout. And if we look at the blocks, there's just our hero section. So we can see these are now saved. So all we need to do is go ahead and click on sync now, and that will now synchronize our blocks and layouts with the Brizzy server. So next we're going to open up a Brizzy cloud site and we're going to see how we access these saved templates. I've gone ahead, created a new Brizzy cloud project, and we've opened up a page ready to take a look. So let's click to start building. Let's open up our saved section. And if we see there's our block, there's our layout. So now we can simply go ahead, choose this and insert this into our design as easy as that. So Brizzy Sync is a great way of being able to access files that you want to work on on different websites. Anywhere you want to connect up to your Brizzy Cloud account, you have access to these Brizzy Sync files and templates.